All right, so I just have some gloss on my lips. I don't have nothing on my face. So you guys can see from start to finish. This look is really basic, 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 but uh, we do some techniques. I do some techniques in order to make my makeup stand out when it comes to pictures. So I'm just gonna start by moisturizing my face and I have been using so much the Derma E um, Radiant Glow Facial Oil. And also this was in collaboration with Sun with Sunkiss Alva. But yeah, let's moisturize the skin. And I hope you guys love this setup. Am I recording? Okay. I hope you guys <laughs> kind of flipped right there. I hope you guys are loving the setup. I have been wanting to film like this, but my phone. I just need the one terabyte. I just need the one terabyte. But yes, I just been deleting so many pictures since I work off my phone. I've been deleting and you know just trying to record here but finally today i deleted more in programs and all that so yeah i hope you guys love this little setup so then i'm going to be using this um no pore zone no pore zone by milani and this stuff works really good i apply it just around where i do have all my pores where you can see it's around my cheek area right here and i pat it I pat it usually I think it works better without with just by itself it works better by itself and I'm just gonna let that I'm gonna let that sink in but so for my brows I did them way different I use the NYX brow glue and then I use a NYX no not NYX what am I saying why am I saying NYX I use um this one which is the palme by benefit you guys this is really really good you have to use a little bit because it is super pigmented but today i am using a different product with you guys which is new which i want you guys to get because it's so freaking good it's just one product like you guys just need one product i was already obsessed with this one i don't know i don't even know how many tubes i use for this um but this one is just everything in one like everything so it is the Thick It, Stick It uh, by NYX Stickening Brow Mascara. And I am using an espresso, the color. I'm looking at myself in the mirror just so it could be in frame. But look at the before, you guys. A little bit goes a long way. Make sure you guys clean like the bottom. My mirror is so dirty. So sorry. So you're going to see that a little bit goes a long way. I'm just gonna do one brow so you guys can see. So I'm just shaping it right now. All the time I use this uh, foundation, the stick foundation by Wet n Wild, and just a regular, this, what is, this is from Vibella, the RG240, you guys. I use a little bit of foundation and then I just shape my brows. Can you guys see that? I shape my brows. I don't use concealer no more because I feel like that is like whoosh, like so much out there. So I use my foundation and my brows are already stuck. Like I don't even need that brow glue no more because NYX came out with a better thing. I didn't even think they could do that, but they did. They sure did. So for the tail of my brow, I just grabbed the same product, grab my brush that I use for my brows. This one has no name, but I feel like it's those generic brushes and then I draw it out. So you can even just take your brush, grab the product at the end and, and then just, you know, design it much better. I already did the other brow and it's always the other brow that doesn't want to, it doesn't want to, you know, help out. But um. Like I told you guys, my makeup is so basic that I already told you guys that I'm doing this. Yes, so I have two of my IDs. One's my permit, which I look really, really light. And then the other one was my state ID. So they're taken with the same lens, girl. I was like, can I see the lens? And I was looking at it, I was like, oh, it's the 18 by, I think it's 135. Those ones make you look big. Those ones make your face look big. And if they use flash, they're gonna make you look bigger. So I think she used flash because look at it. They don't, they don't edit the picture, so this one is the same makeup, but I like this one better. I like that one better. Like, my face looks th just thinner. So, okay, so enough about that. So, 
For my eyes, I did a really basic girl. So I just started with this primer by um, Ace Beauty. This primer is super, super good. You guys know me that I don't use primers. I only use what, a concealer in my eye, but this changed the game for me. Like I just love it, it it's really good. So I'm using it in light and it's really, really thick and super, super pigmented. So use a little bit. Then right here, you just can use your loose powder. I like to use my Airspun loose powder to set that. I was gonna say blend it, to set that. So the main thing on here, um, you can't even tell my eyeshadow. So I just did a brown shadow, but I made sure that my lashes were popping and that my eyeliner was popping. So, and also me, I have like a little bit like hooded eyes and you can't, when I smile, you can't see my shadow. And of course, you're not gonna be able to see your pink eyeshadow glitter and all that maybe glitter yes but you're not gonna see the color of your eyeshadow so the main things that you want to focus on is your eyeliner and those big lashes so so just grab your favorite bronzer grab a brown eyeshadow i use this um maverick by um reblon i have used and abused this palette as you guys can see i love this so i'm just gonna grab that brown shadow right here this one right here I am so freaking excited to start trying. Like, I just want to scream every time. I seriously think I'm going to cry when I get my license. Like, it's that. It's just been one of my goals. That one has been one of my goals, you know, to achieve. And I'm, like, freaking close to it. And it just makes me so happy. All right. So, we're just going to apply that on the crease. Blending it and swiping motions. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a clip on here so you guys can see how the car looks that I'm driving Before I, before I got into the class. I'm like, I hope the car doesn't say student driver I just hope it doesn't but it does it's like a big old student driver at, at the top and like on the side promoting the the um, Business and I'm gonna show you guys also a clip of how it looks on the inside It's so freaking cool. I told the um my instructor I'm like I feel like I'm gonna have to get a little car like this because if I'm getting used to driving a car like this now, I think it's a Toyota, I don't know, I forgot what my husband said. Um, I need one like that. But you guys, I, did I tell you guys? Did I tell you guys? I don't know if I'm telling you again. I freaking drove my husband's truck and his truck is big. It's freaking big. I had to like hop on. I cannot even climb up. I had to like hold on and try to climb up. It's so big, but I drove it. I drove it to freaking Walmart around here. The Walmart by where I live, it's always packed. It gives me panic attacks. It's always oh, so much people. And I even parked it. And I even we even came back. Well, we didn't come back. We went to go put gas. He taught me how to put gas. At the end of the so we have both of the eyes. I get really, really close to my brow bone, but not that close. You know what I mean. All right, so for my eyeliner, I use the Better Than Sex mascara, uh, mascara Eyeliner. I think this is new, which is it's waterproof liquid eyeliner. If not, I use the one from The Bomb. I can't find it right now, but it's so good. It's really pigmented as well. But this, I just love the tip of this. Like, can you guys see that? So for this, we pray and we don't talk, okay? I'll put music on. And I have to have a mirror like close to me. But I will assume you guys in so you guys can see. You know what? I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna talk this time. Okay, let's see. So I put it. Uh, <laughs> that's crazy. My mouth changes. All right. So we're gonna make the line cl close to my the tail of the brow, the brow bone, the tail of my brow, like this. Why can we talk? Like that. And then a little dot right there where the middle part of my eye lid is at. And then we're just going to connect this. Not all the way from the top, just like the halfway. Bring it down. My stomach is burning. I need food. And then just fill everything in. I think I could breathe now. So since it's really thin, I just love to create a thin line right here. Yeah. 
you see that and when i finished like my, my concealer and all that then i like to add the little tail in the inner corner that just elongates my eyes so this would just lift my eyes you guys i'm gonna do the other one behind scenes but i want to show you guys every so every time i always clean clean it with the brush just following that liner you can use a brush or just a makeup wipey or whatever just to clean it so i'm gonna do the other eye right now for mascara i have been loving the reblon mascara the big bad lash i love the wand you guys so i already curled my lashes every time i curl my lashes i have to reapply the eyeliner i hate when that happens so just a couple of coats coats girl i can never talk in here especially i have like a headache a migraine since last night that is going away with the help of coffee because i did not want to take no exedrine today so i just like to coat them because we're gonna put some balm lashes right now for my lashes i have been loving the ardell lashes they're wispies which it comes with a dual line um dual liner yeah dual line it lashes so it's a glue but i i just put the liner or the glue whatever on the lash and then i just place it i don't do that but these are the ones you guys they're the wispies i've been using the ones at the top which they're the Wispies 113. One. Louie wanted to say hi. Oh, oh! His hair is just falling out so much. Look at his green eyes. Look at him. He is so freaking cute. Okay, go on. Be free. Now he's going to stand here because he's going to be want, want to be carrying more. All right, so this is the little glue that it comes with. Oh, wait, you know what? I told you I was going to apply the 113. No, I'm applying the top ones. The top ones are my favorite because the 113 are like, girl, I'm a fly. <laughs> they are so big. But this ones are just so pretty. I hope you guys can see it. They're so pretty. So like I told you guys, I don't apply the line lash glue on my line. I just apply it on the lash and it dries really quick. So be careful. Always, always apply your lashes with a tweezer. I just love it. I feel like I can get in there. Can you guys hear him? He is carrying my husband's shirt everywhere. It's like his safety blanket right now. But yes, a little bit more about the driving, you guys. I will be 35. 35 in March 31st. You guys know my birthday when Selena passed away. That's how you remember my birthday, you guys. When Selena passed away, that is my birthday. Um, but yes, I'll be 35. Natalie just turned 15. This lash. Natalie just turned 15. I'm going to apply a little bit of eyeliner on my top waterline. So you cannot see that ugly empty space. I hate doing this. This is the part that I hate doing of makeup. But yes, I'll be 35, you guys. And I'm like, it's time. Like... When I was learning how to drive when I was in my teens, I feel like it was carefree. I didn't care. I was, my friend was teaching me like through the diesels, the big, big old trucks, you know, and I was not scared. I was bumping the music. What the heck, I was bumping the music and everything. And now it's like, I don't want to hear no music. You guys better not talk. I panic. But now I'm like coming down. I still can't have no music. You know, I have to like focus really good. And I feel like because after having kids, that's how you get. I mean, that's how I got. So I'm like, I'm getting old. I'm tired of Ubers. Like I have to, I have to push myself. I'm like this new year, right when the new year started, I, I kept studying and studying. I'm like, okay, I'm going to go take the test. I took the test three times, the, the writing test. I failed those times, even though I already knew the, the answers. I'm like, there's no way, like they're doing something here. So I was taking it in a, uh, third party place and I keep failing failing and then my friend was like you gotta go to the, the DMV the, D the real DMV so she took me and girl I aced that I was just like click 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 first I was like where the hell is a mouse but it was a touch screen so I'm like is there cameras here because I, I swear I put it on everything I had some answers on my hand I, I was ready I'm like I'm not about to fail this like I can't fail fail this like I study so much. My hubby was testing me, Natalie was testing me, so I was like, I need to ace this. 
so i was just like click 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 and one thing that i liked that my friend was like if you don't know it just skip it and you will get the answer at the end you would like you know have time to study it and put the answer so i was like click 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 and there was one that i skipped because i didn't know i was like i'm not sure so i skipped it i didn't even get to the skip ones because it's like congratulations i was like i i knew it i was gonna pass like i've been studying my ass off i've been doing so many tests online i'll put the link if you're in arizona of the test that i took so so yeah i'm gonna put this brown shade right here just with my beat up brush and just a little bit so i can contour my eye oh i also hate this part of makeup i hate doing this just a little bit i got tired of taking uber so i'm like i'm getting too old the su summer's coming it's super hot here in arizona so after i took my test and i passed it um i called the driving school and i'm like i'm like you know what f it i'm just gonna pay the money and just get my driving school done because two of my brothers already did it and they're already driving one of them lives in colorado and he drove all the way down there i'm like i want to do that like not go in colorado but you know but i want to do it like this quick so that's why i got into the driving school and it's been freaking good i've been learning so much you guys um so now we're gonna put foundation on oh my god this video is just like a little chit chat um i'm gonna put this foundation on which i love the photo focus foundation in color soft beige you guys can find it at family dollar store so freaking good you guys but i've been trying lately for the for the picture i did this one but lately i've been trying my el maquillage foundation which is a little dark on me it's, it's a 120 woke up like this I was just trying to remember how it felt and how it was because my sister-in-law wanted to know more info about it but if i think you can pick i'm going off topic but i think you can pick if it's for um matte or oily i picked the matte one so if you have oily skin that would be good for you okay so a little bit of this foundation i feel like all the foundations right now are really too light for me so i'm just gonna pat it and i'm using this Skin Smoothing Complexion Brush by It Cosmetics. It is really pricey, but it works so good. Don't forget to get your neck and your ear. I am using the CoverGirl True Blend Concealer, you guys. Um, what color is this? Because I know you guys probably will ask. It's the Honey. The Honey one? This concealer, I'm like freaking out of it, but it's so freaking good. Oh, the next concealer that I used was the Multi um, Task Concealer. Yeah, Multi Use Concealer by Too Faced. And this one is in color vanilla. And I just apply a little bit. And this will just help to brighten out. Damn, that's a lot. Brighten out the spots. So right here, right here, right here, right here, and right here. Not on my hair. Right here. Guys, make sure you guys let me know in the comments. What do you guys think of this quality? That way I can keep on filming like this. So I'm going to use the Airspun. Love this one. This one is the translucent wand. I need more coffee. And I'm going to grab my Laura Mercier little sponge. I love that thing. And then just apply this basically everywhere. Ugly. You guys see those videos where they do it so pretty. But I'm applying it everywhere. Especially on my forehead where it's like creasing on me. I want to get Botox so bad, you guys. I'm going to look crazy right now, but don't worry. So now I'm going to be using the Matte NYX Bronzer in Deep. And you want to make sure you go up, not down. Because then that will make your face look droopy. And also on your hairline. Like, get there on your hairline. Go up. Get your neck. Because you want to be bronzed on the neck as well. I'm going to grab the same bronzer. Grab this brush by Royal Olenico, which is their angle eyeshadow brush. And contour my nose. I'm going to start by the edges. Close to my brow. Bringing it down. Then right here, going down. I'm going to grab some setting powder and just bring it down. looks like a lot of makeup it looks like i'm kicking it up but don't don't worry trust the process i'm a makeup artist i got you now i have been loving blush so much so i am using the american beauty rose by milani girl it has like some shimmer to it so with the little stippling brush from sigma and then you want to smile from right here bring it up 
Don't go down. Remember, we want to go up. Everything that we have wants to go up. And I feel like with um, makeup or pictures, you want to like overdo it so it doesn't wash you off. So just overdo it. Who gives a damn? Their pictures are not going to be bomb. Yours is. Okay, so right here, what I do, I set my face and then I pat it. So let me get my setting spray. This is a setting spray from CoverGirl. I can't find my um, Urban Decay one. It's okay. So I do so many steps when it comes to setting sprays. Either I wet my face, wet my makeup brush, and pat it on my face. And then I'm gonna grab my makeup brush and then just pat everywhere while the makeup setting spray is on my face. And this would just blend everything, making it look like it's coming from within. This point, that's when I grab my either my um, eyeliner or just some shadow. I'm gonna do some shadow today and just go in my inner corner, a little triangle. Remember I told you guys about this palette right here? So the Country Palette by uh, Wet n Wild. I always use this side, the yellow side. I need to get a new one. I haven't gotten one. And then I just apply it right here, which this would just brighten that up like instantly. Apply my mascara again under my lashes, on the bottom of my lashes. Grab some setting powder and just cut this. We're gonna cut it. So it can look really defined. And right here, I swear, I feel like this is taking forever because I'm talking to you guys, but when I did it, I did it quick. Like I do my makeup quick now. I mean, I have always done makeup quick. You know, when you do your make when you do your makeup and you do makeup on others, like you just learn the tricks. So for my lips, I'm gonna do a lip liner all over. This lip is lip liner is so good, which I can't find it right now. Where, there we go, there it is. So it's by Makeup Forever and it's in color, what is it? N14, they rarely have names. So I'm gonna take the off my lip gloss. And then, I think this is a different one. It is, it's darker. Well, I don't even know. My daughter will use my makeup and sometimes she'll put it back. So we overline and then we fill everything in. After I do that, then that's when I take this off. As you see, I don't leave it on for that long. And look. And then I just spray myself again. There you guys have the final look. I hope you guys love it. I hope you guys love this video. Thank you guys so much for watching till the end. Let me know in your comments down below um, some tips of how to get rid of anxiety. I mean, I've been watching so many videos, but I want to know your tips. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please share this video with your friends, your family, anyone that's going to go get their picture taken for their passport or whatnot. Send them this video. So make sure you guys comment down below. Give this video a big thumbs up. And also, I'll leave you guys some videos on the side so you guys can watch for more. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.